Coming up on Deadpool Toys 1 2. By Odin, son, I am the son of Odin. You will learn some respect for Thor. Alright, fellow YouTubers, Deadpool Toys 1 2 here. This time we're actually looking at it, a review of the Thor Ragnarok Thor. There is the Mighty Hammer. Then here we got Chris on one side. And on the back we have him holding the sword, how he was not holding it in the movie. With this worthlessness called into question, Thor must fight to preserve the legacy of Asgard and the godliness that he once claimed. Rest of the figures from this wave to help build the Hulk. Open him up. Okay, and here is Thor out of the box, and I might say, I don't know, might have to have Deadpool to roast him. I'm not feeling this one quite as much. Like the type of plastic you usually get on the uh, Marvel Legends, you're not getting that type of plastic. This one feels like, I don't know, it feels a little bit softer. Alright, so for the little cape that was included, it actually is two holes. You gotta plug one in the shoulder and one on the side, and half the time they do not stay in, so that can be really annoying, but you know, it does look cool. Now, I do feel like the weapons are pretty accurate. Dan, this little shin guard does look really cool, and they got all these markings that are also going up the leg that they made all glossy. But this part right here, I don't know, I feel like, I don't know, like his arms look kind of big, but I feel like they might should have been a little bigger. I mean, Chris is a really huge guy. See, the actual size of the figure, I do feel like it could have been a little bigger, because as you can see here, Chris was really bulky, man. And I do like the helmet. I do feel like the helmet doesn't look sloppy. I like the colors, but you see how mine's warped, so I gotta put it under some hot water here. And the face sculpt does actually look like Chris Hemsworth, so I do like how they did that, and I do like that he has his facial hair there, too. I thought the helmet actually could come off, so I kind of wish it did. But they did do a good job at the paint. I think that's why the figure feels so differently because you see how like the type of paint they use is really like kind of shiny and all that stuff and it's kind of glossy. And most of the figures are not usually like glossy. They're like a solid color. Kind of like the, if I grab them, like Deadpool. See like more so more like colors that are solid in here. You actually like you're getting gold in there and then you get the metallic looking blue there. And here's how I look actually holding the hammer from uh, Jane Foster Thor here. It's a little small compared to him. But, you know, just to give you an idea, I am Thor. And also this shin here thing actually can easily come off so you can easily put on another figure. Kind of wish you had both of them, I don't know, but in, I know in the movie you just had one, but I think it would look really cool if they had both. You can probably just switch it over to the other side if you want, however you want it. But I don't know, it's just for some reason this figure just doesn't, like, I wasn't excited to really open up. It's like, oh, okay, the Thor. Like, I don't know, it didn't really, like pop out at me and for some reason i thought you'd be able to do like he did on the trailer in the movie where he pops it up and down but you can't it just stays there but here's thor and he is next to jane foster thor and he is next to chris evans then he is next to century it's the same figure just they made the eyes really weird and awkward yeah i know you're century they think they can repaint a whole bunch of stuff but all i see is century this isn't thor you know what you shouldn't even be in this wave why can't we be friends why can't we be friends Danny, the other next to Deadpool. And up close, you can see this is kind of surprising. You see how much taller Thor is than Deadpool? And Deadpool is like towards the front of the camera. So Thor's really way taller than Deadpool. And he usually is about the same size as most figures. Hey, who saw that Infinity War trailer? Man, we are getting close. I can't wait. Gosh, Caleb, your attention span is worse than mine. Stay focused. Oh, you know what? I bet we just need to go to the doctor. Uh, may I help you? Oh, yes, uh, excuse me, uh, Spider-Man, black and red Spider-Man of this universe. This review is about me, so we should keep the attention on me. I am not Spider-Man. Oh, sorry, I'm very sorry, Mr. Uh, black and red man. Would uh, you be interested in joining the Revengers? The only thing that comes to mind from that is the Avengers. Is that the best you could come up with? I, I mean, yes, on, on the time. It was in the moment, as you should know. I mean, you could have said the Defenders, X-Men, Justice League, A-Team, Mighty Morphin Power Rangers, Golden State Warriors, The Breakfast Club. But anyway, could I be the leader of the Revengers? No, no, no. It, uh, that would have to be me. Why would it have to be you? You're not even the strongest Avenger. I mean, the Revenger. Y yes, yes, I am. Yo, I've seen the movie. We all know it's the Hulk. Oh, yeah, really? How about we fight for it and I can show you how strong I am? Okay, do you have your hammer? Uh, yeah, no. Okay, well, in that scene, do you at least have, like, some lightning effects or something? N no I don't. Oh, lame. By Odin's son, I am the son of Odin. You will learn some respect for Thor. And right now, I will show you just how strong I am. Even with these two blades, I will completely defeat you. For I am the god of- Oh my gosh, you brag and talk so much. 
is the sound of the police! Oh, I love Thug Life memes. Deadpool, you shot him? What? He was just going on and 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 on. Two hours later. <gasps> what happened? What happened to the son of Odin? Well, <laughs> I must have beat him then decided to take a nap. Yeah, that has to be what happened. <laughs> yeah, that I am mighty. But this has been my review of the Thor figure. I hope you guys enjoyed it. It's not a bad figure. It just didn't really like make me excited or anything this time when I actually opened it. But I hope you guys enjoyed my review and I'll see you guys in future videos. Bye.